Hey guys, what's going on? This is um, Chris Martinez, and no, today I'm not going to be doing a cover, and um, I'm not going to be wearing my shades either, because today is a, something that i never done before on my channel. As I said, when I made the judgment day that I was not going to quit YouTube, um, I did say I was going to do some story time, so that's one of these things. Today is story time with Fever. And today's story will be a creepypasta. And it's called Creepypasta My Little Pony The Lost Episode. Alright, here we go. My Little Pony Lost Episode. Written by Silent Killer. Five, two, three. Here we go. <clears throat> so, you know about the show My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, right? Well, on the 17th of November, one of my friends said that there was a never before seen episode of the show. When he told me about the episode, he said he had recorded it in his DVR. It involved Pinkie Pie walking down a bunch of buildings. But the animation for the walk cycle wasn't there at all. It was just still Pinkie Pie moving left for about 30 minutes. Soon after, she did. She said something in Rainbow Dash's voice. I was fine with that. Maybe it was an anime, animation error? But after seeing something like that, I was slightly unnerved. The screen for a split second went to static and showed the first episode of the show starting to play for 20 seconds. And then went static for about two seconds, and then the real episode started. But something was wrong with this episode. The quality was like someone taped it, taped the V, V, V I A, taped the via V H S. Sorry, sorry guys. Anyway, it starts with Twilight Sparkle, but she wasn't happy. That's weird because in the other episodes she's happy. In this episode, she was very depressed. Well, we heard that Spike had died from eating too many diamonds. Well, that's weird, because Spike never died from eating diamonds. Spike is a dragon that's probably 200 years old. Well, no one knows why, but after Rainbow Dash, but after that, Rainbow Dash starts speaking Rarity's voice. That's when, that's when all the weird shit starts happening. But then all the characters started speaking in different voices. It was impossible to tell who was who, and nobody sounded like anybody in the show except Applejack. But when we see outside Twilight's house, Twilight Sparkle starts crying. Not in a cartoon-like fashion, but like the voice actor was crying in Twilight Sparkle's voice. The outside Twilight's house, even though the question did not look like anything from the other episodes, Parts of the house were in the sky, the ground was missing, there was no background, and everything sounded kind of disordered. And after that, after that well, when Twice Sparkle started speaking, it was in reverse. After that, everything started getting more messed up. It went to Fluttershy's house. Fluttershy was in no way happy, but was very mad. Well, she started walking towards the camera. She gets closer to me, and but when she got closer, she was just staring, no blinking like it was a still shot. It went on for thirty seconds, and that stare scared scared the heck out of me. I know I said the word shh in the earlier part of the story, but yeah, I heard that cursing gets less views. Oh well. The next thing that it, that it shows is his Randy's house. Then it cut to a cave and the weird sounds that were never in the show started playing. Then it cut to a bloody twilight on the floor for a split second. After that, the, cred the credits rolled silently and it rolled to commercials. That was, according to my friend, the entire episode. I didn't believe him and tried to get him to show it to me. My friend froze. He attempted to speak but could not find his voice. 
Then he took a remote and bashed me over the head with it, knocking me out. I, w I woke up to find myself still in his house. I looked at the TV and saw the episode paused. It was a toilet sparkle lying dead on the floor. I looked over at the couch and saw something that will haunt me for the rest of my life. My friend was hanging from a rope. His expression was that of Twilight Sparkle, his eyes still on the TV. I ran out of his house and never told anyone about it. A few days the police a few days later the police come to came to his house to investigate. The few officers that went in never came back out. But later that day I got a tape in the post. It had My Little Pony Friendship is Dead on the front. With dead written in in blood red writing. I didn't I didn't put it in fearing the same what happened to my I won't I didn't put it in fearing the same that what happened to me as it did to my friend. That night I couldn't go to sleep. I kept hearing Come play with me in Twilight Sparkle's voice. I still see her in my dreams, ripped to bits, half pony, half he, half skeleton. Then I decided my life was useless anyway. I decided to go play the Twilight Sparkle. The end. And that is the last episode of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. Not a scary story. Actually, it was, but if you hear the actual reader who did it, then you will know why it's scary. So that is about it. With that, I'll see you next time. And um, I'm sorry again for cursing because of the list views. So um, again, like I said, I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, leave comments, subscribe, and goodbye.